Hello, I hope you're well. Welcome to another reading. Let's see what we've got on the cards today. What are the main themes? Oh, miracles. Miracle coming into your life. Got a green there. It's very healing colour. Got a green around you. Heart space chakra. Could be a love relationship. Love is there for the taking, I'm hearing. Oh, look at that. The sun's coming in. Oh, something you've, oh, my stomach rumbling, sorry. Um, something you've wished for that has been a big obstacle to get to, those mountains, is finally coming in. You thought, you thought it was buried between, between, um, underneath the ice. Um, so far, you just couldn't get to it. It was isolated from you. You couldn't get into, uh, it could be an institution, it could be um, a job, um, a very difficult um, job industry to get into, something like that. A love relationship, you thought somebody's heart would never thaw. This could be forgiveness. Um, it's coming to you now, miracles. And the ice is going, this can be isolation from somebody, family members, family member. Um isolated from something but it's thawing it could be your heart as well that is you know being um isolated cut off look it's thawing and the sun's coming out or that pain is being transformed oh that was rather nice wasn't it oh abundance money 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 coming in here holiday holiday Atlantis. Going somewhere you've never been before. Taking on new knowledge. You could be doing new courses. There's marine life here. Um, lots of abundance again. Um, I'm seeing the dolphins. New friendships. Being led somewhere by spirit guides. To your new vis vista. The wizard behind the curtain is being revealed. It reminds me of the Emerald City, only it's not. It's Atlantis. So you could be gaining some new gifts, um, having something illuminated. Emotions calming. New knowledge. You could be getting knowledge about Atlantis. You could have a connection to Atlantis, be um, a connection to the angels of Atlantis, or you could be connected there's some connection to, and I'm getting the Muria as well. So there could be some new knowledge being revealed to you. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've got a communication coming in. Some new knowledge. The library of knowledge is opening for you. To find out your next course of action. Some spiritual journey you're doing. Um, the sun is guiding you, connection to sun god, sun. Hmm. A course of action must be deliberated, I'm hearing. Could be a connection to China. Hmm. Deliberating something. Um, conjecture of it. I don't know what's going on there. We'll find out more in a moment and I get the main theme. The truth is a big factor for you now, knowing the truth about yourself, who you are, what you do, what you stand for. That is coming into being. You can deny the truth no longer. Yeah, there's big expansion going on in your life. We've got Jupiter energy here. You're expanding your minds, not your minds. You're expanding your mind with knowledge. You are, um, you are uh, transcending, um, going up a level. You're getting knowledge in through your crown chakra. You are expanding. Eleven, awakening, finding the truth out about the world, but yourself in particular, what you stand for, what you came here to do. Feeling fear no longer. You're on the right path. Yeah, so focus on it. No more fighting and whether is this the right path or not. You know now it is the right path. Okay, interesting. 
crows over there. All right. Let's see what else we've got going on here. Vitality, getting a lot of vitality, uh, feeling um, fit in all senses of the word. This isn't going to resonate for everyone, but remember, um, you'll know if it's your reading or not. And as it's for entertainment purposes only, you know, please be aware that if you have any health problems, mental health, financial, career, whatever it is, legal, uh, please be going to the relevant professionals for help before you take any advice from this video. Okay, um, greet the darkness. I think you've already greeted the darkness and you're coming out of it. There was something you had to go through. Um, number 19 is relevant. We've got a siren. Or somebody could be having to greet the darkness here. Um, being stripped bare, seeing the truth of who you are, your wants, your needs, um, the darkness within you that needs to be integrated with the light. Uh, here where the spine bends and the mouth quivers, breathes the hidden, the pieces that make you whole, but cut deep with all their sharp edges. So there's something about integrating the light and dark side of you. You may have been having some nightmares, having to face some problems from the past. The truth is coming to you. Once you do that, truth is being revealed. Got a warning there for the, every time I hear sirens. Oh, and somebody's put a robin on the table, which is a massive warning. For me, um, when I did the world predictions uh, reading before, which you can check out. Oh, uh, that was, we had the Banshee card out of here, which was something coming in. And we've got sirens, so really hope these aren't the Banshee cards. Oh, we've got three, so we'll take it. Waiting for the right thing to come along and then pounce on it. And it's coming in. There's a communication coming in about job. Love relationship, candle magic, connecting to the spirits to find out information. And again, All Hallows Eve, the 31st of October. Something coming in in October. I always get this. Something being illuminated. Some connection being illuminated in October. Part of your journey, your life journey, part of your... Um, awakening a truth coming in uh, there's a warning about something coming in here as well that may try to knock you off this focus but it's a truth that has to be heard it's been kept from you we've had that before haven't we um okay who and what is keeping this what is this truth and who and what is keeping it away from them from the collective sorry me yeah some of you are still in this dark period a warning about what you're seeing and hearing it may not be the truth find out the the real truth somebody's playing with you trying to distract you from your focus for a reason because they want to still be with you what we got here digest you're having to digest some information that may not seem palatable um but you can work with it. You can change it around to your advantage and you can use it. You haven't been given a truth. Somebody's lied to you. I've got that again. Um, somebody's lied to you and you're seeking the truth. You can use the lie that they told you to find out the truth. I don't understand that, but somebody out there will digest the information you've been given every time i say this i always think of this as a wheat allergy right um something that's undigestible to me is this virgo though so it's you could be dealing with a virgo something that's undigestible that just doesn't ring true that makes you queasy that just makes you that's not right or you see something that makes you feel queasy it's not quite right i need to report that i need to i don't know what it is it's, somebody's sensing something dark about someone and this person has sensed that you know that and they're trying to cover their tracks and they've told a lie and it's it's almost like a, a sixth sense here it's a real um 
you really know, you can't prove it, but you can use their lie to catch them out. It could be a Virgo or you could be a Virgo. Um, you know, that's not finding some truth. Could be to do with a child. You're waiting to pounce. It's almost like you're asking your guides, angels, God, spirit, you know, whoever, to give you more information and something will come out in October. Your suspicions are correct. Hmm, we've got abundance and community here. Somebody's building a community. It could be on YouTube, social media. Something about jewellery. Online, Instagram, building a community. Again, we've got Jupiter. This expansion could be expansion in your business. But it's definitely a money here as well. But it's expansion within you. Okay, expansion within you, being aware of what you need to do to bring that abundance in, the truth of the matter, having to let something go that has been has kept you stuck and somebody else has kept you stuck with it. It may be people who are preying on you. Oh, stay. We want this from you. We want this from you. It could be clients, anything like that. But when you actually do it, there's no reaction. They just want, it's almost like, this could be a relationship as well. They want to be able to see you at all times and when they want you, when, they'll pick you up when they want you. It could be a friend of me here. Um, but otherwise, I don't want you today. Okay? You've got to start thinking about you. Somebody keeps you at a distance. The hardness in your heart is thawing to allow love in again. To allow someone back in again. But be on your guard. For a while longer. Until they prove themselves. And then the sun will come in. If they pass the test. I don't know what that's all about. <laughs> There's definitely a community. Something being shown to be untrue in a community. A communication to a community. A piece of knowledge. Um, that must be deliberated. But this is a community. A family could be as well. Some information coming to a family. Interesting. On a copy of delights for someone. We've got quite a few different things going on here. But where the person who calls you at nine o'clock in the evening, they bring bad tidings that they could have waited to tell you. They're going to disturb your sleep. They could have waited to tell you, but it's almost like pressing a button. And somebody's demanding your attention whoever I'm talking to, all the time. They need to be let go of. They're very manipulative. This could be, I'm getting mother figure, father figure, parental figure, guardian type figure. Wants your attention all the time. There's a change coming in with that. Uh, a passing will free you. Oh. Don't like say, saying that. Um, don't feel sad. It was time. I don't know if that's another message or the same. Oh, but there you go. It very rarely means that. It means big change. It's big change coming into your life. Because of this expansion, you may be getting an inheritance as well. Um, but it, there's a twinge of, yeah. Something coming back from the dead you thought was gone. Something that was buried deep is being resurfaced, rising like a phoenix. And that could be well be you. That could have been how you thought about yourself, that something that you wanted to do was over. I've got green here. This is heart chakra. I'm wearing green. Heart chakra healing. And we've got all this lovely green. So something is healing in your world. Thawing. And then we've got the sun coming in. Okay. Okay. 
home. You could be getting a home, miss you at home. I'm seeing floorboards being pulled up, rot in the floorboards. Somebody's pulling it up with a hammer, Sylvan Black Hammer. Um, there's rot. You may find a hidden letter under there. Don't know. Aquarius. Collaborate. You may need to collaborate in your work with somebody. Blending something together to get this abundance and success. There may be two areas of your work that you need to blend together to make one to um, be successful. But I'm getting that this is something you do yourself. So it's almost like, um, well, for instance, I have two channels, okay? And it's almost like putting them together in some sort of fashion. Uh, well, I've done that on my Patreon page, but I haven't got it all going yet. But I'll be able to offer you readings for um, Patreon um extendeds and all sorts in the very near future if you're interested um and uh, readings for you know um members or things to buy off as a one-off purchase but so that is like me doing it all not collaborating with somebody else that may be uh, necessary for you to do but it's almost like you have two things that you need to integrate as one and start pushing and marketing them as one. Somebody has got to do this on Instagram. Something to do with jewellery. Bring the two together. Then they'll work. It, everything will flow better. And people will appreciate it more. Oh, I've got my call there. Okay. Right. There's definitely some communication coming in. Um, I'm finished with these ones. Progressions. Journey. As part of your journey. Uh, right. What I picked up here was wrath. So there's some sort of anger that needs to be transmuted. You have to start working with yourself. Forgive yourself. Um, forgive your anger. Um, let go of the anger so you can start working with yourself. Integrate uh, the light and the dark in yourself as a whole to work better in love, in relationships, in family relationships, in anything. Uh, in work in particular, there's something that's making you very angry, but it's bringing in a big change and expansion. It's almost like you're channeling it into something that works for you. Let's go for the tarot and then I'll go back to the crows. What's this anger about and this message, this communication, please? No, that one. Oh, something's ending, right. Okay, so there's a passing. Somebody's passing somewhere. Something is ending. Um, is somebody passing? There's, um, I'm getting three people passing. So I'm very sorry. Um, but there's end of something, end of an era. Because we've got ten of swords here. Somebody uh, has been betrayed. And this could be a job ending as well. It's causing a lot of anger. Why wasn't I told? Why wasn't I told? I've got little lights on that. I should have been told. I should have been informed. So there could be somebody passing that you're not told about, that you're just finding out about. Truth. It's going to make you very angry. But they want you to focus your anger. Not focus it, sorry. That's wrong. Um, Channel it. Keep focus, keep calm, and do what you need to do to be heard. But keep calm, constructive, and you will be heard. Or somebody is beginning to pass over, that you know, prepared to pass over. I, d I don't know. Why wasn't I told I keep hearing? Yeah, choice. This person had a choice and they didn't come back to you. Yeah, somebody's causing mischief about this. Somebody's not telling you something that they should have and it was their choice not to and they're causing mischief. They're causing a lot of disinform disinformation, misinformation. They're trying to hide something from you. It could be a path, the passing of someone, inheritance. Yeah, you've definitely got a vampire around you. 
energy vampire. Something has ended and somebody does not want to accept that as well. And they're causing mischief. You've got several vampires around you. Joan. Francine. Peter. Richard Tops. Mark Stafford. Please, as in the fish. I don't know what that's about. Somebody, please. I, I don't know. Bob, please. Okay, but you need to be on the lookout for communication. Uh, that's unveiling a truth um, that should have been revealed to you sooner. Somebody's been causing mischief and vampire. And this could be to do with inheritance or somebody passing. Sudden, suddenly, truth kept from you. Yeah, again, rest is definitely a big change. It's going to cause a massive change to your life, a huge change. Something is coming in. There's some information it could be from the spirit world as well. Communication, your spirit guides to cause a massive change in your life or you're being directed to allow this big change to happen this time. I'm seeing a tornado. So something's coming in to cause you anger, but it's going to change things for the better and allow you to expand bring in money possibly but it is the end of an era something is ending today and beware the person who rings at nine o'clock because they're mischief maker gossiper and mischief maker they're going to give you some disinformation um you have the choice whether to believe them or not but seek the truth there's a mystery around this. Whoa. They caused a storm by doing what they did. They're going to make out that they were doing you a favour, that they were um, helping you and the circumstances weren't right and this other person didn't want you to um, tell them uh, something like that. But it's mischief making. They're causing a storm. That um, your spirit guys want you to calm down. I feel quite emotional. Calm down from uh, not give them what they want. They want to rise out of you for some reason. Three, transformation. It's going to cause a massive transformation. It may bring in money if they're in inheritance. Yeah, you are protected right now, your God, your spirit guys. You are protected from this storm. Okay, uh, there is a storm coming. I get sick of storms. It's a mischief making storm. Somebody has caused it. It will return, return to sender. It will go back on them. It's coming from a community. It could be family. Keeping the truth from you. But I want you to remember that there's this as well. Miracle. And the sun coming out. You will get there. You've just got to, for some of you, you have to go through this little bit of dark to get to this. Um, there is definitely somebody who believes they're locked out of an industry, locked out of something, but it's thawing and the sun's coming in. There's a communication. There's a job offer. Two job offers. We'll go at the crows to finish off. And we'll see how that goes. Let me know in the comments if you would like extended readings. Um... If you would like, uh, you know, be interested in joining Patreon, I'll leave the link to my Patreon page and you can um, see what you think. Let me know so I can provide, uh, you know, what you'd be interested in. Mm -mm, that one. Yeah, there's an awakening happening through this. You may be getting... Um, I don't know if you're... What that is. Waiting for something. Stop waiting. You don't need to wait any longer. Come here. Right, so we've got this awakening. We've got this anticipation. Why are you waiting? Go and do it. Commit. The energy will move and you will get to where you need to get to go. What you were doing before. Look at that empty seats there.
you know the path that you need to be on commit to it the energy will be it'll cause a bit of a displacement a bit of a maybe a shock move here um you know cause somebody to throw their toys out of the pram but it's essential that you do it yeah communicate and a communication is going to cause this for somebody it's arriving at nine o'clock at night Stop putting lights on all these other something that's going to uplift you from the roots. It's something that has rooted you and kept you stuck in a misguided belief system and waiting. It's going to be changed. It's going to uproot it. And you are going to be able to expand and move on from this hurt. But it's going to cause a storm. So prepare but prepare for this expansion and this abundance that comes after it all. It will change your life. Beware the mischief makers around you from this community. There's a community causing a lot of mischief. Could even be spelled with it there. There could be something you're doing that people are jealous of and they're causing mischief. Could even be through... You know, speaking ill of you, spell work, whatever. Trying to get you to come off your path. Hmm. Make sure you're in balance. Seek some peace, go out in nature. Whatever you need to do to get peace. I see somebody sitting on a bench somewhere. Beware the memories of the past and the self-interest of those from the past. There's teamwork to keep you off a path. Or if you, um, on the other hand, need to be working in a team, you will get more successful. Somebody's been uh, given the job of team leader. You're on the right path, no matter what they say. You're on the right path. Somebody's trying to lead a team and there are people not turning up for meetings, things like that, but going and having secret meetings and finding ways of how to oust you. Oh, you felt that. You felt that paranoia. Hmm. What's your advice for all this, please? <clears throat> Choose direction. Stick with it. Keep on the right path. You know in your heart which is the right path. Use your insight. <coughs> Somebody's not speaking out with my throat. It's got really dry. <coughs> Somebody may have a tickly cough, can't speak. That's my voice now. You need to speak up. Oh my God. <coughs> Excuse me. You need to speak up. Communicate. Use your insight. Tell the truth. Somebody's really been blocked here. Observe what's going on around you. Gain information. And communicate to the relevant people. Beware of the distractions around you. Release your fear. You can win this. You can move forward. You are protected all the time. Integrate. We had 55 on the clock there. Which is numbers for big change. Cataclysmic change for the perpetrators of this untruth on this, the people who made you wait for this information. Whatever they say, stand your ground. Final one. There's an anomaly somewhere and you've seen it. Make sure the relevant people know about it. Okay, I can see my guides doing something around me here because they come over my face that's how they work and they're moving my eyes there's something odd around you that you need to see there's something displaced around you some energy displaced around you something you need to see become aware of and protect yourself from i can see them moving their eyes i'm looking at you here but it's almost like they're looking at something over there. 
this could be something coming in off youtube if you have a um a channel there's something there's something well that's creepy i just heard it. Mm, somebody going it you found me out did you yeah i have and that's what whoever i'm talking to for here as well needs to for the anomaly and not anomaly <laughs> anomaly hidden in plain sight get rid of it return to sender is somebody mimicking someone else okay it's almost like uh they've been in some cases have been brought back into your world uh so you learn from the past they represent somebody or something, an energy from the past that you had to walk away from, didn't like. They've got your full attention and you've got they've got you off the path and they're just playing with you like a toy. Please be aware there's something around you that shouldn't be there. And it's causing, it's dominating your thoughts. Scavenging for energy. This could be um, dark energy, it could even be demon energy. I, I don't know, but it's more like somebody from the past that likes to play with you, has been observing you, knows how to get under your skin and wind you up. Okay. Where did you want that one? Yeah, put you in isolation. It's all to get territory from you. All to gain um, domination over you and your thoughts and your ideas. Really squashing you. To gain territory. It could be to put you off your work so you get thrown out. They could be sabotaging you at work. Taking credit for your successes, whatever it is. Or they could actually be messing with your work. I had somebody once. Um, a secretary who took my work away and changed the letters and what I was uh, doing because she thought she could do it better. Well, fair enough. Go and get a job in that that field and don't be a secretary anymore. Could be something like that. This could also be spirit making, you know, letting you see all these things so you make this big change and expand because you're capable of so much more. Do not let them squash you. Do not keep waiting for something that's not going to come. Move on. Expand. Create. Okay. Oh, one last one. And distance yourself from these frenemies. They'll get their comeuppance. It's just a matter of time. Okay. I hope that has been of some use to you. If you would like a personal reading, any coaching, anything like that, link in the description. Please, I do them all through paper. You can book direct through paper bell. Okay. Um, I don't speak to anyone on TikTok or anything like that. You must go through paper bell. And that will list all my services and, you know, uh, whatever you uh, wish to uh, do. And uh, yeah, you might have things coming up from your memory. Remember the truth of them. Luck is coming in for you. They won't stop giving me comments. Sorry. So yeah, please do that. Um, check out the World Predictions channel. I've got some messages on there about other things as well, not just World Predictions, that may be of interest in what goes on around me with all these beings and that that I see. Um, I'll try and leave some uh, videos on the end screen. And yeah, you may have to change your perspective on something. Oh, this is going to make the peace is going to come in. You are getting there. It's a long, hard journey, but you are going to get there if you make these changes. It's everything hidden is being revealed to you right now. And um, we seem to all be going through this plutonic energy uh, where the hidden, it, very intense feeling Scorpio. Okay, there's a lot of Scorp Scorpionic energy around. So, um, yeah. Um, Check those out as well, yeah, and my Patreon page if you're interested. Take care of yourselves. Thank you for subscribing and watching. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you so much. Take care of yourselves. I shall see you next time. Bye.